Hi, welcome, Simon here, and I hope you're doing well. In this video, I'll be adding additional RAM to the Lenovo laptop. First, let me go ahead and shut down the computer, and I'll show you the model of this Lenovo. You can check it by turning it in the back of it. You should be able to identify, it says IdeoPad 315ITL05. All right, let's go ahead and get started. All you need is a Phillips screwdriver. Let's remove all the screws here. So if you're looking to add additional RAM, or maybe that um, you want to change the battery or anything, I'll try to list it down in the description below, and I'll try to walk you through it in this video. Uh, okay, so all the screws on the top and the middle are much longer and the screws here at the bottom is a lot shorter so they are not the same I just want to keep that in mind all right once I've removed all of the four screws at the bottom let's go ahead and open up the back cover what I did was I just go in between that plastic cover and lift it straight up that is the um, internal part of the computer now this is the battery if you're looking to change the battery all you have to do is to look up for the number here it says L16M2PB2 that is the model I'll try to link it down in the description below we will direct you to either Amazon or eBay we can find a replacement battery uh, for the Lenovo to disconnect the battery all you have to do is to slide down the connector like such and that would disconnect the uh, the battery okay now to install the RAM again in this video we would like to upgrade the RAM so let's go ahead and get this started just want to install the battery back in to remove the RAM is very simple all you have to do is to push this two little metal bracket push it both away from each other so like that you're gonna push it away from each other and then the RAM would pop up slightly at a 45 degree angle and you can slide it right out okay let's take a look at the RAM this is the uh, PC4 meaning that it's DDR4 has 4 gigs on it if you want to upgrade it to like a 8 gigabytes or maybe like 16 gigabytes then you can buy one of this RAM okay to ins install the RAM is very simple making sure that the RAM gap is matches the RAM slot like such okay slide it in a 45 degree angle and once you have it in a position kind of hold it down and push it down you will hear the little click would we'll click back on and lock the RAM simple as that and of course you don't have to do any configuration on the RAM you just have to put the back cover or the screws back in and that should be it all right and again I like to uh, point it out to you if you're not sure where to buy the battery check the link down in the description below if you're not sure where to buy the RAM I'll list the RAM in the description below where it direct you to either Amazon or eBay. Okay, thanks for watching. Until next time, bye now.